Hi, Randy, K7AGE. In this video, I'm going to make a WinLink connection to um, KF7RSF Tom, his WinLink uh, gateway station in Bandon, Oregon, about 50 miles north from me, using Vera FM as the modem and using my ICOM IC9700 to a vertical antenna up about 55 feet. It's a um, Comet GP15 70 centimeter vertical antenna. On Ham Nation, a couple nights ago, a couple days ago, I went through this presentation that was in the previous video, and I asked the viewers to send me a WinLink email at k7age at winlink.org. So now I'm going to log in. I haven't logged in to the WinLink system since Ham Nation uh, was aired. So hopefully I get one chance to, to do this <laughs> and get it all get it all right. So what we have going here, look at the main screen. Um, this area here is the main WinLink um, screen. And again, WinLink is email over the radio. So you can see here, um, I have all the various messages that I've received. And uh, this is kind of the, the main control panel for, for everything. Down in the bottom right is the session window. And when you open the session in the main WinLink window, you get a session window pop up. And this is now basically the radio connection. And... Um, I, and we're using Vera FM, so when you open that up, um, you also get the Vera FM modem window that opens up. And this is going to show um, your volume levels and your, your data rate and things like that. So, again, the main, main window, uh, you open the session, this pops up. This is Vera, this is going to use Vera FM for the for, the, for this session, so it also opens up the Vera um, FM window. And I have my 9700 here sitting on 144.95. Uh, okay, we're hearing audio from that. And if everything's going right, I should be able to go over here and click Start. We'll see if we can make it a connection. Here we go. There we go. Getting data. Okay, it's handshaking. It's getting set up. I can see that in the session window. It looks like I have three emails. N7BEF, AA6BD, K7AHA. And it's neat, you can see the various um, uh, data rates that the Vera FM modem is shifting through, and it's all done. <laughs> I got all the emails in one shot there. Um, let's go back to the session window. And I can't point to it when I'm doing this, but. Um, Kind of at the bottom there, it says end of session. Total messages sent was zero. Zero bytes sent. And the next line is messages received. Total bytes received, 1,121. Total session time, 37 seconds. And I was getting 1,700. And, and I'm getting 784 um, bytes per minute. Then it disconnected. Session was 0.6 of a minute. Average throughput said zero. One minute peak, zero. So anyway, I, I have some email now. Let me go back to the main. And I can double click on these. And there, this is a uh, message from uh, Steve, N7BEF. Hi, Randy. I went down the rabbit hole in Vera AC after seeing... Uh, after your discussion, uh, no more digital mode to add to my PC. Thanks. 
I'll answer him back in a second here. Uh, acknowledgement, okay. Open this one here. This is from AA6BD, Bill. I, he says, I saw your segment on Ham Nation. I want to send you a win link email to you. This is going via Vera FM. Very good. And this one here is from K7AAH, Mike. Just watch Ham just watch Ham Radio Nation. Enjoy your talk about the digital modes. I thought I'd reach out with an email sent on my end up in Seattle via Winlink slash Vera FM. I've been exploring Winlink as well in the last week or two. Really enjoy your YouTube videos when you post them. <laughs> it's been a while. Maybe I'll hear from you on the air soon, though I think you're in my HF skip zone. Well, it depends what bands. I, one of the projects here in the next couple of weeks is hopefully get a 40 and 80 meter dipole back up. So I'm going to pause here for a minute. I'm going to um, reply to these guys and uh, we'll send it out. Stand by. Okay, so I've replied to uh, two of those. I'm going to reply to the third one here so you can see. Double click it open, hit reply. And I'm going to say, uh, hi, Mike. And I've used this text on the other couple here. Um, so I'm saying thanks for your thanks for your email for my segment on Ham Nation. I'm working on a video of my WinLink session, which is what I'm doing right now. And uh, I'm going to tell them thanks for watching my YouTube video. 73, Randy, K7, AGE. Okay, when you um, finish with this and it's the way you want it, you post it to the outbox. This is what's a little bit different than email your normal email applications. Let's get a do a couple steps here. Now I can close that. I'm going to unmute the radio. And if I look over here in the outbox, it says I have four. So there's the three emails and then the acknowledgement back to um, AA6BD. I go back to the inbox. And I'm now ready to send the emails. So you go back into the session here, and you click on the start, and off we go. Making the connection. Sending four messages. Three emails and the acknowledgement. You can see the green bar going across here. Send all the data. I'm done. Messages sent four total of 2,031 bytes at 4,429 bytes per second. Session in half minute. Average throughput 4,865 bytes per minute. One minute peak throughput was 44,865 bytes per minute. Excuse me. So there it goes. Connected to the uh, WinLink node. Had it download the emails to me. It went pretty fast. <laughs> and I'm using and I'm not using the fast or the wide Vera FM mode. I'm just the um, default or the, the the slower one but it's still a lot faster than the packet so we've uploaded we've downloaded read the messages replied to them posted in the outbox started a new session which uploaded the messages and if you'd like to send me a winlink message k7ag at winlink.org and you don't have to use winlink to send it you can just open up your phone your mail application, k7age at winlink.org. Thanks for watching. This is Randy, 73.